Hello, everyone. It's Anfernita. Today's story is called God's Mirror Image. The memory verse is from Genesis chapter one, verse twenty-seven. It says, "God created man in His own image; male and female He created them." Today's message is: We praise God. For creating us, all week God had been busy creating a lovely world. It was the sixth day, and He had finished creating all the animals. Then He lovingly formed man out of the fresh earth. I can imagine that for a moment, He just looked at it, smiling at the thought of the wonderful times they would share together. Oh, my dear Adam, God might have said. How I love you! Then God breathed His breath of life into the form He had made. Instantly, Adam's chest began to move up and down as his lungs inhaled the fresh, clean air. Smiling into his Creator's face, Adam sat up. "Hello, Lord," he might have said. God showed Adam all around His beautiful new garden home. Adam, you may name the animals. Adam grinned as he looked around. What a fun job! He got started right away, but as he worked, he noticed that every animal God had created had a mate. Was there a mate for him? God caused Adam to fall into a deep sleep, and while Adam was sleeping, God took one of his ribs and formed a beautiful woman. When Adam woke up and saw his wife, he was filled with love. God blessed the first wife and husband. They spent their very first whole day together, enjoying God's company. God gave them the Sabbath as a special gift. They loved the garden home God had made for them. Each evening, they would walk together in the garden and talk with Him. It was such a wonderful time; they couldn't wait to be with God. One sad day, however, Adam and Eve made a wrong choice. They chose to listen to Satan. God had told them that they could eat of every tree in the garden except one, the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. The happy couple didn't want any part of that, but unfortunately. Eve ate the fruit that the serpent, who was really Satan, offered to her. Then she shared it with Adam. Immediately, instead of wanting to be with God, they felt afraid and hid from Him. But God still loved them. He did not stop loving them because they did a wrong thing. He had made them in His image, and He would always love them. Because Adam and Eve disobeyed God, they had to leave their garden home. No longer could they meet God and walk with Him in the evenings. But God loved them so much that He had made a special plan so that one day they could live with Him again. God loves us, and He wants us to live with Him too. This podcast is read by Franita Buddy for GraceLink.net. Created and produced by Falvo Fowler. Post produced by Faith Toe at Studio El Piso. The theme music is by Clayton Kinney. Animation and artwork by Giogo Godoy. The audio engineer was Karel Holness. For more information, please visit GraceLink.net.